Hello friends, we will make today a reverse string which is a normal entry question. So let's create a WPF application and project. WPF As usual, let's first create the UI. text block which will be present over <coughs> so let's make it as the name input box let's make some width as to these are not mandatory but yeah, you can Let's make the text with input text and let's bind the with content numbers. Let's make the width as hundred height was thirty. Okay. And Let's bind the command. So let's make this property approach to the on property change. Let's keep some option to this. Let's jump to the view model. Before that, we will copy the rely command as usual. So let's create a rely command. <coughs> Let's make 
okay but no so let's okay. uh, Let's assign the constructor.
Deus, um carrinho. So whenever it will be update, it will call it. Let's run it. <coughs> yes, we have to assign also the query context. Okay, let's end it. Let's assign it here. So let's start a project, let's do the string, let it run. It. So we'll see. My string is not converting. Okay. So let's stop it. Let's put some debug point. Rating the point. Let's see where is our command and where is our errors. So it's hitting the point and converting the reverse the text. So what is the reverse text? Yeah, it is this. So Let's see. So let's see whether our yeah. So this is the issue. We don't have this one. Okay. Let's apply and read up. Yeah, 
so it is reversed now so you can let's remove the debug points this is a, so let's reverse it so it is now reverse okay like shashi reverse shashi so successfully we reverse shashi thank you friends just uh, we will introduce more real-time interview questions shortly thank you like share and subscribe